film the yeah. air quality alert, even going mm -hmm. into to tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Have yeah. we had an update about the upstate? The upstate is not going to okay. be in an air quality alert unless they tomorrow. unless DHEC changes their minds overnight. Mm -hmm. That's one good reason to tune in on the morning news because all the latest data mm -hmm. in. But as of now, we're not expecting another air quality alert for the upstate. But it actually still is in effect until midnight. So now that can be a little bit confusing. But tomorrow it is not in effect. Tomorrow the mountains will be looking at an air quality alert, and that's going to be throughout the day tomorrow. That code orange, uh, sensitive folks, if you have asthma, the very young toddlers and the elderly as well, a little more sensitive when to limit your time outside in western North Carolina. Now we're still tracking a little bit of light rain across the area from Clemson to Anderson down toward Lawrence, and we've got a pocket of heavier rain just on the southern side of Union County uh, that's working its way toward the east. But overall, it's mostly just sprinkles and light rain extending through Greenville and toward easily as we head through the next few hours notice that light rain will continue by the time we head towards 6 7 a.m most of it thins out so i don't expect you to get soaked on your way to work or taking the kids to summer camp in the morning but you will have some clouds around and a stray shower or two and then the clouds will thin out we'll be looking ahead to a dry afternoon and it's going to feel really nice outside too so better air quality is on the way toward late this week even the mountains we should see some big improvements by friday and saturday drying out through saturday too not looking at any big rain chances and then by sunday those afternoon storms will be back in the forecast. So let's get a look at your next 24 hours tonight. Temperatures dropping to around 60 and that the rain is going to be settling down over the next few hours. 54 for you in the mountains with those smoky skies hanging on. And we'll have some clouds on Thursday. Friday into Saturday, we've got mostly sunny skies, highs in the low 80s, 70s to low 80s in the mountains. And the clincher is it is not going to be humid, so it is going to feel so nice outside so as we get this air cleared out. The humidity drops. This will be a great time to spend with the family outdoors Friday into Saturday. Humidity does shoot up quite a bit as we head towards Sunday and Monday when those rain chances are on the rise. Now, if you're thinking about heading to the South Carolina coast this weekend, some great weather's on the way. Beautiful, mostly dry, and a high UV index, too, so put on that sunscreen. So going into this weekend, just a slight chance of rain on Sunday, 50% chance of rain into next week. And then we'll be looking at Tuesday, Wednesday with more scattered showers and potential thunderstorms in the mountains. A first alert weather day for tomorrow because of air quality. Friday, Saturday, we'll see mostly sunny skies and temperatures slowly warming up about a 30% chance of rain by Sunday. Be sure to download the Fox Carolina First Alert weather app to keep up with those air quality alerts. We'll let you know if any are issued for your area.